All right, Dr. Blumenthal back here in the Bethesda office with Natural Transplants, and we are pumped. We have Samantha who is rejoining us. Look at you. Oh, my God. Um, so we are it's, – it's been a while since we've connected. So it's, it's actually probably been more like a year and a half since your second procedure. You had two. Um, the first procedure went well, but we just need a little bit more pop, a little bit more density, and boy, did you get it. Oh, my goodness. I sure did. Um, tell, us, so tell us all about it. How'd it go? Yeah, absolutely. So both procedures were awesome. Um, just to share a little story, a little yeah. backstory. Um, I have been doing research about hair transplants since I was like 11 or 12 oh years my God. old. Because oh, really? unfortunately, yeah, as a kid, yeah. you know, my hair was done too tight and I didn't have edges for a long time. Yeah. Um, and so I finally did it and I have no regrets. Um, both procedures were very smooth. Um, everything was explained Good. thoroughly. Um, I had very minimal pain, honestly. Uh -huh. um, you know, I followed the instructions of the doctors, of course, to take my medicine as needed and things like that. Yeah. Um, but absolutely no complications. Um, Good. Just, you know, just I had to wear scarves and hats yeah. a little bit, but it was just a minor sacrifice, you know, yeah. um, in order to get these results. And so I would do it a thousand wow. times over. There, there's, the time. there's definitely some awkward stages you sort of have to fight through throughout the year, but ultimately yep. it's it's <laughs> worth it. And it's, uh, it sure. looks fantastic <laughs> look at this smile the smile says it all um yes, ha ha it. have other people noticed a family member friends anybody else sort of noticed and remarked about it um so only people that are very close to me like yeah. know that i've had the procedure done like people don't they don't pay any attention to it at all right um, right which is good you know yeah which is good yeah, yeah. that's what you yeah. want but i'm certainly not embarrassed to share it either you good know? Like awesome Awesome, awesome. Well, what I'm going to do, if you don't mind, just kind of drop your head a little bit and hold it for two or three seconds. And the braids, you you assured me the braids were not tight, so every so be really tight. careful. I did them myself. Okay, all right. And then what I'm going to have you do is look to the right or left, pick a side. Perfect, beautiful. Oh my gosh, it looks fantastic. And the other side, and we're going to put up the before pictures up there as well too. So, wow, awesome. looks fantastic, Yay. fantastic. Thank you. Um, I always call you guys my hairline heroes. Oh, so let me put that out there. <laughs> I like. I mean, I'm going to make a T-shirt. I like that. That's good. Yeah. Um, any words of advice for anybody out there that's sort of thinking about it? You've done research for years, so you're sort of the as much of an expert as anybody else out there. What What sort of your words of advice for people? Yeah. So um, definitely do your research, but of course, I would always recommend this clinic, this practice, oh. these doctors. You guys are excellent. Yeah, um, yeah. But do what's comfortable for you. Yep. Don't be afraid to take that risk. Um, don't be afraid to make that investment because it is certainly worth it. Yep. A yep. thousand percent worth it. Good. I promise. It's definitely an investment. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Um, thank you, Samantha. Again, appreciate that. Hopefully this helps somebody out there. Um, you look fantastic and uh, so, so happy for you. Thank you so much, Dr. Awesome. Blumenthal. Right. Good to see you. Take care. Bye-bye.